Hello, you're welcome. How to solve this nice exponential equation? Solution from here. And what we have here, we take 9 raised to the power 6 to the left hand side. That is, we have x raised to the power 6 minus 9 raised to the power 6 that equals to 0 here. The next step, we can write this as x raised to the power 3 or raised to the power 2 as 2 times 3 here gives us 6 minus also 9 raised to the power 3 then or raised to the power 2 equals to zero here and this follows and we have a square minus b square with same thing as a plus b into bracket open bracket a minus b then here yeah, a standing as x raised to power three and b standing as nine raised to power three then what we have here all of this and becomes x raised to power three plus 9 raised to power 3 into bracket also open bracket x raised to power 3 minus 9 raised to power 3 close bracket equals to 0 here then here yeah, we have two possible cases first one x raised to power 3 minus plus 9 raised to power 3 equals to 0 or we have x raised to power 3 minus 9 raised to power 3 equals to 0 here that is solving on this side this follows when we have a raised to power 3 plus b raised to power 3 with the same thing as a plus b into brackets then open brackets a square minus a b plus b square that is here yeah, what we have becomes x plus 9 into brackets open brackets x square minus 9x plus 9 square plus brackets equals to 0 here that is this is the same thing as x plus 9 into brackets open brackets x square minus 9x plus 9 square here that's 81 plus brackets equals to 0 here then here we have two possible cases uh, this is the first one x plus 9 equals to 0 or we have x squared minus 9x plus 81 equals to 0 here then solving on this side this follows on this becomes x equals to minus 9 which is a real solution here then here we have a quadratic equation we are here equals to 1 b equals to minus 9 and c equals to 81. Now apply quadratic formula, which is x equals to minus b plus or minus square root of b square minus 4ac all over 2a. At this a we have x equals to minus minus 9 plus or minus square root of minus 9 squared minus 4 times 1 times 81 all over 2 times 1 that is here we have x equals to minus times minus as plus and we have 9 plus or minus square root of minus 9 square here that's 81 minus 4 times 1 times 81 we can write it as 4 times 81 then all over 2 that is next step here we have x equals to 9 plus or minus square root of 81 is common here we factor it out this becomes 1 minus 4 left here all over 2 then here we have x equals to 9 plus or minus square root of 81 times 1 minus 4 minus 3 over 2 and when we have root a times b we can separate this as root a times root b then here we have x equals to 9 plus or minus roots 81 times roots minus 3 over 2 which implies here we have x equals to 9 plus or minus root 81 that's 9 and minus 3 that's root 3i over 2 this year we have two complex solutions here then 
Solving from the second case is that this follows when we have a raised to power 3 minus b raised to power 3, which is the same thing as a minus b into brackets, open bracket a square plus a b plus b square. That is, yeah, what we have becomes x minus 9 into brackets, open bracket x square plus 9x plus 9x, 9 square close bracket equals to 0 here. And this same thing as x minus 9 into brackets, then open bracket x square plus 9x plus 9 squared as 81 plus bracket equals to 0 here. Then here we have two possible cases as well. First one x minus 9 equals to 0, or we have x square plus 9x plus 81 equals to 0 here. So in here we have x equals to 9, which is as we have a solution here. Then here we have a quadratic equation where a equals to 1, b equals to 9, and c equals to 81. Also applying the quadratic formula, what we have become x equals to minus 9 plus or minus square root of 9 square minus 4 times 1 times 81 all over 2 times 1. Then here yeah, we have x equals to minus 9 plus or minus square root of 9 squared as 81 minus 4 times 1 times 81, can write as 4 times 81 all over 2. At this here we have x equals to minus 9 plus or minus square root of 81 is common here, factor it out and we have 81 into bracket 1 minus 4 left here, close brackets all over 2 here. Then, next step here, we have x equals to minus 9 plus or minus square root of 81 times 1 minus 4, that's minus 3, all over 2, which implies we have x equals to minus 9 plus or minus, we can separate this and we have root 81 times root minus 3 over 2. That this here, this becomes x equals to minus 9 plus or minus root 81, that's 9, root minus 3, same thing as root 3i all over 2. Also here we have two complex solutions here. Therefore, all together here we have six solutions in this problem. Two of these solutions here, two complex solutions here, and also two complex solutions here. And thank you for watching. Don't forget these steps. Subscribe for more videos and turn the description bell. Share this video, give it a thumbs up, put your comment. See you next class and bye for now.